The Democratic Labour Party has found itself at the centre of controversy, this time regarding the renaming of the George Street Auditorium after Barbados's first Prime Minister, the late Errol Walton Barrow. Messages making rounds on social media indicate that Barrow's son is not pleased with such a move, indicating that the family of Barrow was not even given adequate notice. Yet again, there's another primary school being impacted by environmental woes. This time, teachers are concerned about the incinerator smoke from the Grant Lee Adams International Airport that could possibly disrupt more classes at the St. Bartholomew's Primary School. Their concern is that the absence of teaching staff could interrupt students preparing for the common entrance examination for 2024. St. Vincent and the Grenadines says that it will be tightened up surveillance in the event that leprosy is detected in that country. The Health Ministry says that it is monitoring the situation in St. Lucia and Barbados where the disease was detected for the first time in several years. Another Caribbean country is seeing a rise in acute respiratory illnesses. This time it's Anguilla. The government in Anguilla says that both the flu and COVID-19 continue to be detected in that country, with the latest surge being attributable mainly to COVID-19. Nine people are now dead after Pakistan launched retaliatory strikes into Iran. According to the BBC, Pakistan says its strikes had hit terrorist hideouts in Iran's southeastern Sistan Baluchistan province. Iran condemned the attack, which is said to have killed three women, two men, and four children. Officials have reported that a special investigative prosecutor who was looking into the TV station attack in Ecuador has now been killed. The attorney general informed that Cesar Suarez was shot dead in the port city of Guayaquil, Guayas province on Wednesday, January 17, 2024. In today's weather, a weak low-level instability is affecting the island. The general forecast says it will be cloudy with sunny periods with the occasional brief scattered light to moderate showers. With the Capital Media News Brief for Thursday the 18th of January 2024, I'm Mishron Robinson.